Hey Strikers, this is SF and welcome to Striker Change. This time it is Neon from the Sorcery of the Big City series and I'll be bringing her with Lady Rokujo and Tsunayoshi to uh, Minamoto Yoritomo. Uh, although Minamoto Yoritomo is not that great of a monster, he does have a command strike shot, a short turn command strike shot. He only has one no ability which is why people don't really like him. And there's a lot better no damage wall monsters but that command strike shot can be handy and he is a relatively easy monster to get so why not let's bring dodgy because why not for the friend slot there it's always good to have laser bump combos because there are laser bears uh, on the monsters that you don't want to kill but Minamoto is kind of an underrated it is really underrated because there are a lot better monsters out there but it's kind of solid with the command strike shot and the Dark Slayer, if I remember, if it's that form. But the main point is to not kill that drone, because if you kill that drone, then you get lasered. And the hard part about Neon is to position her for her bump combo. So it's been a while since I've positioned for those one-way bump combos, but I think I should be okay for the most part. Okay. And if you kill off the mini boss, then the drone's dead. And you will be fine. Okay, finish it off with Dodgy. Perfect. Next stage, starting off with Neon. And gonna use it to position for the most part. Just position down low for Neon. And. Bokujo just to hit. Everybody, of course, Shine Laser is not the best bump combo in the world, but Neon does have a really good strike shot. It has a clone strike shot, of course. If you're using a clone strike shot, it doesn't match well with the. It is a clone strike shot, right? Yep. Uh, it doesn't match well with her bump combo, but it can deal some heavy damage for a finisher type of move. So it's always good on that end. Okay, next is. Turtles, more stalling and more positioning away or under people. And almost there. And the finisher. Okay, good. Can we see one more stage? One more real stage? Okay, there he is. And let's just try to clear off. Yori Tomo as much as we can or as fast as we can. And let's just go side to side. Because the good part about the Trident Laser is that you can hit the monster even if she's beside him. Because one of the uh, one of the lasers do hit the boss. And next it's Naoshi, let's just go around. Nice. Trying losers not doing that bad. And the drone is gonna be killed very soon, so let's finish off Yori Tomo. I think he only has one more left in him, so finish it off. Good. And there goes the drone. Thank you very much. And finish it, finish that last mob off and push Neon downward. Okay, boss time 20 turns. Starting off with Tsunayoshi. Not bad in terms of Neon. So let's try to get down there. And I didn't, which is fine, I guess. As long as the drone doesn't die, then it should be okay. Most people, if you want to play safe, just clear off that dark monster there. And holy crap, that was just off of Neon. <laughs> holy crap! Well, I did, uh, Daji did hit Tsuneo, uh, Minamoto a little bit, but still. That's a lot for that Trident Laser. Ouch. Uh, but let's clear off Yoritomo. I hope. Yeah, there we go. Lady Lokujo has the Samurai Slayer for the boss, so that's why I'm using her. 
Come on. Oh. That's fine. And I'm just gonna hit Tsunoshi for the homing. Okay. Next stage. I know the last boss bar is on the bottom left. Okay. That's fine. Neon, let's just go side to side. And Lady Lokujo, let's just pierce and finish off the boss. Can she finish off the boss? Yes, she can! Samurai Slayer OP for this stage only. <laughs> and Lady Lokujo can do Tsunayoshi as well? No, she can't. Uh, she does have a Slayer for Tsunayoshi, but I think that dungeon doesn't have gravity bears. Okay, last stage. Starting off with Dudgy. So let's use Dudgy. Just go side to side. And hopefully this will be enough to deal most of the damage. Nice. Neon as well, good. That's a lot of damage. And Neon's right there. For the clone. And that should be it, I hope. Yeah, there you go. And of course her bump combo does require, and you know, the troll, <laughs> the troll finish. Of course her bump combo does require a lot of positioning and stuff, but her strike shot is more than enough, in my opinion, to uh, get uh, people max lucking. And there's not a lot of clone strike shots out there for fireballs, unless you're counting. There are like two or three out there, but they're really hard to get. They're either impossibles or colossals, or very limited monsters like Clucky. And the clone ones are Hakua and Arcadia for the Farmables, so Neon is not a bad choice. But that's pretty much it for me. I hope you guys like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Thank you for watching my video. If you want to see more of my videos, then be sure to click the annotation in the middle. And I also have a special discount code for you on Japan Code Supply. If you want to buy some Japanese gift cards, including iTunes cards, thank you. And hope to see you guys next time. Bye-bye.